summer I met with Alec Hoyer and Daniel James and we worked on writing and creating an original score because there is no music that is written for the script. It's all unique and original. We brought in our amazing um, adjunct professor Benjamin Mertz and he has been working with the two young student musicians to help sort of shape and guide an original soundtrack and underscoring. Over the course of the summer, both myself and a couple of students, Alec Boyer and David James, were composing some music. Let's do a sad part or something. That's very sad. <laughs> Dark wire. We're writing an original score for Metamorphosis. Wait, hold on, stop, wait, stop. Record the violins first. So we're using multiple software programs, including Logic and Pro Tools, to produce all the instruments through MIDI. That's actually the note I need. So it'll be like like 10 to 20 minutes of just sitting thinking about the chord progression followed by like five minutes of actually putting the music together. We took the instrumental ensemble and we taught them this music, in many cases not knowing yet which scene it would be used for or how we were going to use the music. I'll go from different instruments like guitar or bass or drums or something like that to then conducting as needed. From the point where we were working on the score ourselves um, until Alex started teaching the exploratory and we started working with the other musicians and the musical directors, I think it's been going, it's been getting better and better. It's a kind of musical and emotional intelligence that goes into being able to create an ambient, uh, connected theatrical experience that has live sound in it. Daniel threw together those two chords, which is all of Midas is, and then we kind of put a little, um, you know, jazzy uh, ensemble of instruments to go with it to give it that, you know, kind of copy ghost full feel. became just one guitar um, sequence, became a huge set of ambient noise, and just something that really put a dark, arm, ominous tone into the scene. More, I need more, more, please. But he cannot shake this hunger, salami and ice cream, liver and donuts, every egg in every possible combination. But Poseidon and his sirens had arrived. The rest was one enormous green catastrophe. You know, big and powerful, obviously, because it's, it's the mid storm. So we had a whole, um, like, taiko drum pattern. Reef the sails, the waters, to the bar. Some stuff we kept, some stuff we changed, but I think ultimately it changed for the better and it really helped shape what is the play. We are really happy with the result <laughs> and how it's turned out. And how it's turned out.